Hey, we're cooking wild. Today we're making maple bourbon lake trout, fresh from Lake Superior, and smoked potatoes. Let's get rolling. We'll start out with some fresh fillets straight from Lake Superior. Hard to beat. We're going to use cooking wild maple breakfast sausage seasoning as a rub. Works on all kinds of stuff. The potatoes are going in a smoker. Can't say I've tried that before, but experimenting is what keeps it interesting. Matter of fact, I guess I like to experiment a lot more than I like to cook. A little Cajun seasoning on the potatoes. Sometimes you want to pull out the small Y bones, but actually these fillets are small enough, I really didn't bother. Wrap them up and into the fridge till it's time for the pan. For me, when it comes to lake trout or salmon, I like it a bit sweet. The maple rub will sweeten it up, but I like a little bit more. So we're going to whip up some variation of a bourbon sauce to top it off. Bourbon, of course. Brown sugar. Some molasses. Worcestershire sauce. A little bit of cumin. Add a little zinc to it with something balsamic. Gotta have pepper. Cook that down till it gets somewhat thick and you're ready to go. Made with pure UP maple sugar. I've used this as a rub on pork butts, ribs, fish, and of course it makes great maple breakfast sausage. Now let's top it off with some candied walnuts. Toast them up in the oven for a bit. Heat up some butter and brown sugar. Toss in the walnuts, spread them out to set up and you're done. Bust them up and put them on about anything. Today they're going on fish. So there you have it. Pan-fried maple glazed lake trout topped with balsamic bourbon sauce and candied walnuts. Oh, and the experimental smoked potatoes were delicious. <laughs>